For over a century, the Big Bang Theory has been the leading explanation for the origin, evolution, and expansion of the cosmos. Yet, despite its widespread acceptance, it remains unable to answer several fundamental questions about the nature of the universe. In recent years, advanced astronomical tools, most notably the James Webb Space Telescope, JWST, have revealed anomalies that are not only puzzling but potentially paradigm-shifting. In 2023, one of the most surprising findings came from the James Webb Space Telescope. The observatory detected celestial bodies that appear to be older than the universe itself, a result that has left cosmologists grappling with the implications. If these observations are correct, they directly contradict the currently accepted age of the universe, approximately 13.8 billion years. One such star, HD 140283, nicknamed Methuselah, is located about 200 light years from Earth in the constellation Libra. What makes this star particularly notable is not just its speed, moving at 44.88 kilometers per second, but its estimated age. Initial calculations suggested Methuselah was around 16 billion years old. Later, this figure was adjusted to approximately 14.46 billion years, still with a margin of error of about 800 million years. Even accounting for this margin, it remains older than the universe according to current cosmological estimates. This contradiction presents an obvious paradox. How can a star be older than the universe in which it resides? One explanation might lie in the methodology used to calculate the age of stars. Astronomers rely on a combination of indicators, such as brightness, color, and rotation speed, to estimate stellar ages, comparing these observations to theoretical models of stellar evolution. A method known as gyrochronology measures a star's rotational deceleration over time, offering clues about its age. While Methuselah's age might have been overestimated due to unaccounted variables in these models, the discrepancy still suggests our understanding is incomplete. Rather than simply questioning the star's age, some scientists propose that the age of the universe itself may need to be re-evaluated. Current estimates are based largely on observations of the cosmic microwave background, CMB, and measurements of the universe's expansion rate, known as the Hubble constant. However, new theoretical work suggests that the universe could be far older than previously assumed. A proposal by Professor Rajendra Gupta at the University of Ottawa has reignited discussions on the universe's true age. Gupta suggests combining two different concepts, the tired light theory, first proposed by Fritz Zwicky in 1929, and evolving physical constants. His reinterpretation of cosmic redshift as being influenced by both universal expansion and photon energy loss leads to a revised age of the universe, approximately 26.7 billion years. If correct, this theory could potentially explain the existence of stars like Methuselah without violating the laws of cosmology. It also challenges the assumption that redshift is purely a result of expanding space raising the possibility that light from distant galaxies may also lose energy due to unknown processes occurring over cosmological timescales. These theories are controversial, and many experts remain cautious. Yet, they reflect a growing acknowledgement within the scientific community that existing models may be too limited to fully capture the universe's complexity. This re-evaluation extends beyond stellar ages to the structure and behavior of galaxies themselves. Recent measurements from the European Space Agency's Gaia satellite have also cast doubt on previously held assumptions. By precisely mapping the positions and movements of nearly 2 billion stars in the Milky Way, Gaia has provided evidence that the outer regions of our galaxy are moving more slowly than anticipated. This has led some researchers to hypothesize that the Milky Way contains significantly less dark matter than earlier models predicted. Since dark matter is thought to play a critical role in the gravitational balance of galaxies, any shift in its presumed abundance could reshape our understanding of galactic formation and motion. One recent study estimated the total mass of the Milky Way, including stars, gas, dust, and dark matter, to be around 200 billion solar masses. This is roughly five times lower than previous estimates. 
If confirmed, this would suggest either a major overestimation of our galaxy's mass in earlier calculations or a fundamental misunderstanding of how dark matter is distributed. Such revelations raise critical questions. Are our models of galactic dynamics flawed? Could dark matter be behaving differently than expected, or could its influence be overestimated altogether? The answers to these questions have far-reaching implications. They affect not only how we interpret the past but how we project the future of cosmic evolution. The laws of physics, assumed to be constant throughout the universe, may in fact vary across time and space. If physical constants such as gravity or electromagnetic force have changed over billions of years, this would drastically alter our understanding of everything from stellar lifespans to galaxy formation. Moreover, the search for life beyond Earth has added an entirely new dimension to these inquiries. The James Webb Space Telescope is capable of analyzing the atmospheres of distant exoplanets by using spectroscopy during planetary transits. When a planet passes in front of its host star, starlight filters through its atmosphere, imprinting chemical signatures that can be analyzed to identify potential biomarkers, such as water vapor, methane, or oxygen. The detection of such molecules doesn't confirm life but can significantly narrow down the search for habitable worlds. JWST employs two critical instruments for this purpose. NIR-SPEC, near-infrared spectrograph, and MIRI, mid-infrared instrument. Together, they provide a comprehensive view of a planet's atmospheric composition. Comparative spectroscopy, where data from different exoplanets are compared, further strengthens the analysis, helping scientists distinguish between biological and non-biological chemical processes. While we've yet to discover definitive signs of extraterrestrial life, the capability to do so has never been greater. Each observation adds another piece to the puzzle. Whether it's the identification of biosignatures in exoplanet atmospheres or the discovery of planets in habitable zones, the evidence continues to grow. At the same time, the fundamental forces shaping the cosmos, dark matter, dark energy, and gravity, remain poorly understood. Together, dark matter and dark energy are thought to make up over 95% of the universe's total mass energy content. Yet, they remain undetected directly. Their presence is inferred only through gravitational effects and the accelerating expansion of the universe. If we can unravel their mysteries, we may gain insight into the very fabric of reality. As the James Webb Space Telescope and other missions gather more precise data, we may find ourselves forced to rewrite key tenets of modern cosmology. The possibility that stars could predate the universe, or that the universe is far older than previously thought, poses a formidable challenge to the Big Bang model. It also opens up exciting new possibilities. Could the cosmos be part of a cyclical process? Was there something before the Big Bang? Could our universe be one of many? These questions blur the line between science and philosophy, between empirical observation and speculative reasoning. But they are no less important. Each new discovery pushes the frontier of knowledge and forces us to confront the limits of our understanding. In conclusion, the universe remains an ever-expanding mystery. From ancient stars that defy explanation to galactic structures that challenge existing models, we are continuously learning, and unlearning, what we thought we knew. The next decades promise extraordinary breakthroughs, and as we stand at the edge of this vast unknown, one thing is certain. The journey is far from over.